Larry, maybe what we would start with, if you could lead us off, we talk about these campaigns have major stages. That's what we were talking about. If you can kind of give us a sense of how you view those stages. <clears throat> well, thanks, Barry. Uh, before I hit the stages, I want to talk about the preparations. Many of you are on boards of directors of nonprofits uh, or, or clients who are nonprofits, obviously. Before you enter into a, a multi-million dollar campaign, you, you need a vision. Uh, the, the organization, what are you raising money for? Do you have a, a $500 million vision or do you have a $100 million vision or a $5 million vision and a strategic plan for the organization? Campaign uh, funding objectives, what are you going to spend the money on? Do you have your executive leadership and board leadership in place? Uh, does it need to be upgraded? Case for support, something in writing that tells me why you want my money. And it's got to be compelling and to the point. Campaign plan, a donor pool, uh, an opportunity to build that donor pool, a budget for the campaign, and again, people to ask. What are the phases of a campaign? The leadership phase, we call it, some people call it the quiet phase, but the leadership phase is when you go out to your family, your inner circle, your board members, your campaign cabinet, uh, your, your boards of advisors, if you have them, and perhaps some of your best donors. Those are your leadership phase gifts. Hopefully, like in many university campaigns, a third of the goal comes just from the board of directors itself. So you need to hope that your board has been built around the notion of philanthropy and, and that they're available to you. And then the public phase, you continue your major gift and your major donor fundraising, but then you reach out to broader communities uh, via, via social media, direct mail, events, and so forth to sort of wrap up the campaign and make sure everyone who wants to be asked to support the campaign has been asked in some fashion. And, and that's a big part of where Chad's work comes in, is, is warming up that inner circle, warming up the, the major donors, but letting the public know that this campaign is going on and how important it is. 